I'm also going to let you take us into the next topic. Okay. What do you got for us? Sure, no problem. So last week, uh, Nintendo revealed their new console, the Nintendo NX, which is now called the Nintendo Switch. Mm -hmm. And, you know, um, I'm a big Nintendo fan. I've always grown up playing Nintendo. So I, I love, I was super excited and hype about it. And then uh, towards the end of the trailer, uh, <laughs> they, started, <laughs> they started showing like people playing Splatoon. Now I love Splatoon, so Great. I was like seeing this and I was getting super excited. But then, you know, it sort of transitioned into this very esportsy kind of thing. You know, they have the people playing and you see them running into the arena and they're all like cheering and everything. And so, you know, we have a perfect example of what it seems like Nintendo says, you know what, we're gonna start focusing on esports. The interesting part about this whole thing is that Nintendo already has a game that kind of is esports. Yeah. <laughs> you know, Smash has been played for a very long time. So Smash Melee has been people have been playing this for years and years and years. And you know, and they and they at E3 they had the Smash 4 little tournament there where they invited some of the top players and so, you know, there already is a successful esport that Nintendo has and it seemed weird to me that they're kind of promoting this concept of esports, but they didn't do anything with Smash. <laughs> like, I mean, if they even just showed a little bit of Smash, or maybe just like they could show Smash 4 being ported onto the to the console, or or just acknowledge Smash, I think that would have just been a huge win for them. Um, the only thing I will add, though, is I, I can kind of understand that Smash might be a, a licensing nightmare because they right. have so That's many. So, so that was yeah. my concern with like, what, or one of my one of my concerns with it was like, if you put Smash Four up there, instantly you create this thing where the, the melee community is like, hey, our game's better, and like <laughs> we get more viewership or so, like whatever like the arguments mm -hmm. always come out, and it started, it started it's like almost tainting the commercial a little bit, right? Potentially, like I don't I don't think the community is necessarily that childish where they're like, hey man. You should just make Melee HD already, you know? <laughs> they but, should, but... <laughs> but I, I can understand Nintendo, who is like this like super conservative company in terms mm -hmm. of how they approach these kind of markets, and they're like, let's just take our own little homegrown game yeah. that we have this little league. I think they have like a league in Japan for it or something I heard, mm -hmm. someone mentioned that. Uh, so like, I can see them wanting to go with like a safer marketing tool because they're just trying to show like, hey, you can use this for eSports too. And they don't need to show like their, their high quality game. Right? Everyone already knows what Smash 4 is, right. who plays Nintendo generally. Mm -hmm. I mean, they, I, you know, I have a real issue with the whole arena thing that they in this commercial because, <laughs> like, split like Splatoon's ever gonna fill an arena. Um, but on, <laughs> hey, no. <laughs> on top of that, uh, I saw a lot of comments from I don't know if I'd say maybe not hardcore uh, esports personalities or, or media or whatever on Twitter, just like kind of excited that Nintendo acknowledged. I guess right. esports in this yeah. way, and it's like, but this isn't. I mean, this isn't esports. This isn't what we know or what we see as esports right now. Especially with when you have this golden opportunity to announce either Smash or a port of Smash or right. Melee HD or whatever. Um, I think they missed the boat on that. But also just putting out this perception of like, hey, we're esports now, but not really. I, I don't know. Yeah. I just really have. Yeah. An issue this with is that. this is a classic example of a traditional video game company. Uh, trying to jump into a scene that they don't understand. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, uh -huh. And it, it's it, the esports, like it or not, the esports scene is extremely, extremely different than the video game scene. Mm -hmm. And uh, you cannot force an esport into the world. And, yes. uh, and you, you've seen that time and time again with various companies. Uh, now that Dylan's gone, I can say here, here's of the storm. Um, <laughs> but uh, companies trying to force in uh, uh, that's perhaps a little harsh. Uh, trying to force something to become an esport. And the only way that you build an esport is by building a fan base and, yeah, and by yeah. becoming beloved within a specific fan base that happens to be able to grow and grow and grow. Well, I, mean, I know that for Splatoon is really big in Japan, so mm -hmm. you know that is something that they'd probably want to push. And and, and, as, and as I was trying, uh, what, as I was mentioning earlier, what I'm worried about from Smash, because Nintendo owns all of Splatoon, there's right. nothing that they can put out that's going to be a problem. But I, I feel like you know with. Uh, you know, Sonic the Hedgehog and like uh, Bayonetta yeah. and Cloud and all these other characters in Smash 4, like, do they have the ability to just throw all that stuff out there? What is are it contracts gonna, that right? Is do they have to create new contracts to yeah. say, hey, we're allowed to do this kind of thing? So I'm wondering if that maybe is why they're a little tentative with Smash Brothers. But I mean, it could be also be as simple as the idea that they just don't have another Smash game ready to show. Right. I mean, that's, that's a true. possibility. Mm -hmm. uh, but like, why not just show? Because I mean, 
Like your scene's gonna be happy if you see like yeah. like if, yeah. I, if I'm a Smash uh, Four show player. Smash Four. I mean like I'm, sure, I'm, sure <laughs> if I'm a Smash Four player and I see Smash Four like getting recognized like that. That's uh -huh. that's cool. And I don't see why they wouldn't you know put Smash Four on that yeah. on that console. I, I Speaking mean, of that console, like oh Nintendo, please stop making gimmick consoles. I just not a gimmick console. It looks neat. It, it looks, looks neat. Awesome. I like it. It's I like neat. The idea. I wanted, There's good. I can't wait to go play basketball. And yeah. Then, <laughs> yeah. And then. <laughs> You bring my switch Michael, so we can I don't play need, some NBA I don't, need 2K. Your, don't need your sass, Michael. Look, the the one <laughs> thing that I've I kept saying was that I as soon as soon as I saw the rumors of what it is, I've been dreaming about this kind of console yeah. where you can hold two controllers in your in separate hands, put the monitor like on a treadmill, and you can do <laughs> this, and you can play with both hands. I mean, how cool is that? <laughs> I, I had that same dream with the Wii when I was like, oh my god, you can use a sword like it's real. And then Nintendo yeah. crushed my dreams by <laughs> failing to put out any game that satisfied that. Just, so I just, I'm just warning you, mm -hmm. don't get your hopes too high. It's, it's Nintendo. They're going to do dope stuff on this thing. Everything they do is dope. I mean, but like they like so. This is kind of what we're saying. Where like it doesn't like pander to like the the core audience. Like that's yeah, not yeah, that's yeah. not esports. I say that, I say, <laughs> yeah. I say that as a Nintendo fan, not as yeah, an yeah, esports yeah. fan. Uh, yeah, I think <laughs> Nintendo I, for life. Yeah, yeah dude. No, I'm <laughs> no, but they, for sure. they should have just shown a melee HD or just, I mean, they could have just shown Smash and just people would Smash. be yeah, just show Smash I mean, Four. Even if they right. showed Smash Four and they wanted to make it esports and the licensing is an issue, maybe they could make a port where they just take out all the guest characters. Yeah, why not? I mean, that yeah, could I'm, just work. Uh, that could work. I imagine that would or annoy. Melee HD. Or Melee HD. Or that's always Melee HD. <laughs> Smash 4, if you took out some of the characters, they might complain about the validity of it. Right. But uh, either way, that's all the time we have for this round.